open a new text document, type at, echo off, start a new line. I'm going to paste in this next command. This command starts PowerShell and it sets the item property of the document with the following path. Then we declared the name of the property, which is read only, and we're changing it to a value of true. This line is a five second pause, which gives PowerShell enough time to execute the command. Start a new line, type start, win word, open quotation marks, enter the document name, close quotation marks. The quotation marks are because the document has a gap in its name. Click file and save as. Give your file a name. Save it with the .bat extension for a batch file. From the save as type drop down list, choose all files and click save. Close your notepad file. Double click the batch file you've just created to run it. And you can see at the top it says our document is read only. So to make changes, we would have to save this document under a different name. To remove the read only attribute, create another batch file. Run the same PowerShell command, just change the value to false. Double click the batch file to run it. Then if we open our document, we can see at the top, it is no longer read only. Subscribe for more computer tips and hacks. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.